Hello, Bethel. Welcome back to worship this week. So glad you're tuning in once again in this new reality that we're experiencing right now. I kind of thought that maybe a fun game for you and your families might be to anticipate what's going to happen to Pastor Dave's hair when he's not able to go see Brian Tudgy for weeks and weeks and weeks. We'll see how big uh, this hair gets on top of me uh, as it grows out. And it's, it'll be a curious thing for all of us as we walk this journey together. Hopefully last week you had a chance to be a part of the community worship service for Easter. I am so grateful to be in this community, the Sheldon community, working with the ministerial association that we have here, the great spirit of our radio station, KIWA, that they made that possible with the broadcast. And even though it was a full-on blizzard that day, there were about 120, 130 or more cars in the parking lot there at the Sheldon High School. Probably some of you were there listening on your radios. It was a great morning as we, as we celebrated our risen Lord together in a completely new way. We will always remember the Easter of 2020. If for some reason you couldn't tune in that day and you missed it, KIWA has posted that service onto their website and we have a link to it on our website so you could listen to it. Uh, maybe you just want to listen to it and experience it. Again, it was a great morning. Bethel's praise team was a part of that and along with many of the other churches of our area. So if you want to do that, look for the link and, uh, and experience Easter in that very special way. Speaking of our website, we also have a new page on our website. It is a giving page. I want to thank our deacons for taking the initiative with setting up a different way for you to support the ministries of Bethel and continue to help us meet our bills and our obligations in this time. So many of you have been so faithful in sending in your gifts or dropping them off at the office. Thank you for that, for maintaining that, that level of support for Bethel as we go through this time. But there's now another way for you to give. It's, there's a page on our website, the Give page, and we've set up a, a, with a, an application called Tithely. It is an application that was recommended to us by the RCA, and we think it is a great application to help us with online giving. So you can go to that page and you can set up your account. You can use either a debit or a credit card or tie it directly to your bank account and, uh, and designate how much you want to give. You can even set up recurring uh, gifts that'll happen weekly, monthly, however you want to do it. And I tried it out this week. You can download an app on your phone as well. And I tried it out this week. It worked just, just super smoothly, very easy. So if you want to support Bethel through that online giving, through your phone, through the website, check that out. If you have any questions, feel free to call the office. Speaking about uh, connecting with the office, please do let us know about any prayer needs or concerns that you have, anything, anything that you're aware of about needs in our community or among our members. Please keep us posted because uh, we continue to pray and seek ways to connect with one another. Speaking of ways to connect, our consistory is going to be meeting this week. We won't be meeting at the youth house like we usually do. We're going to be meeting through a Zoom meeting. It's a great uh, online application that, it, that facilitates group meetings. And you can see one another uh, on your screen. Uh, and you can have a gathering of quite a few people. And so that's how we're going to be meeting this week. Please be praying for our consistory as we continue to navigate these, these new, new days uh, as leadership of our church, we greatly appreciate your prayers. And if you need to let us know anything, please do so by contacting the office, contacting one of the elders or deacons or me. You can just send me an email, send me a text, give me a call. And I hope all of you are finding ways to connect. You know, you can do the Zoom thing yourself and connect with people from church that you haven't seen in a while. It is a, one of the marvels of modern technology that makes it possible for us to, to stay connected in this very interesting time. Continue to pray for our church, continue to pray for our leaders, and, and continue to trust God. His great goodness to us will be shown in many different ways, and many of us have experienced that already. Jody and I have. As we go into worship today, Jody has picked uh, four songs, I believe, that, are, that we have links to, uh, the, the videos, some wonderful songs. There's a song by Zach Williams that really moved me as I as I heard it. I had never heard it before. Jody found it, and uh, I thought it just it was a wonderful, wonderful celebration of the, of the resurrection of Jesus and that reality. We're going to be talking about that as part of the message today. So be blessed, Bethel. Hi to all of you. Can't wait to see you face to face again. 